Hey Praise Community, Pastor Brian Connolly here, wanting to invite you to be part of this awesome opportunity we have coming up uh, in the fall, beginning September 27th. We're launching our very first ever prophetic school called The Unveiling, and the reason why it's called The Unveiling is found in Romans chapter 8, where it talks about that creation is groaning for the revealing of the sons and daughters of God to come forth on the earth. And Acts chapter 2, 17 tells us that God is going to pour forth his spirit on all flesh. He's been doing this for thousands of years, is continuing to do it, and that your sons and your daughters will prophesy. And I believe that part of what creation is groaning for is for you and I to come forth in our prophetic nature, to be the extension of God's voice that you and I were created to be, not just in the things we say, but in how we posture and live our lives. I believe one of the clearest examples of what God is wanting to release is found in, in probably one of my favorite stories in the Bible. It's the story of Hannah in 1 Samuel chapter 1. We have this barren woman, and I believe more than ever that the world is tired of barrenness. It wants to hear the voice of the one that created it. In, in 1 Samuel chapter 1, we have this woman who's groaning and travailing for a son to come forth, for God to open her womb, to have a, a male child. And God not only blesses her with a baby boy, he blesses her with a prophet. He blesses her with somebody that was going to be the answer to, to a time when the word was rare, the word of the Lord was rare in the earth. And I believe that that word is not necessarily rare in the church, but it is rare outside of our walls. And God is wanting to raise you and I up. <clears throat> and I believe that this school is going to be instrumental in helping you and I to become what it is that God created us to be, the extension of his voice. So this first semester, we're going to be tackling your relationship with God, how you grow in it, what does prayer look like, what does it mean to hear his voice, and to discover who you are in Christ. This first semester is going to strip you down to bare bones and bring you to a place of health where you know you can minister in confidence and when the that the river flowing out of you is coming from a pure place. So I just want to invite you, come be a part of the unveiling September 27th. We hope to see you there. Bless you. I hope to talk to you soon.